Thank you. Good morning, good morning, good morning, Greater San Marcos. I am so honored and excited to be here and to try to share with you in a nutshell what it is my company does. My name again is Taffy Nelson Hauka, thank you. And Mayor Houston and Dr. Horton, thank you so much for being here. Once again, my name is Taffy Nelson. I am the founder of Maternity Momentum. I'm a service-based company offering strategies to attract, retain, educate, and maintain your valued employees. So in a nutshell, I'll play this. How can one red line affect the rest of her life and your bottom line from the moment she realizes I'm going to be a mother? How am I going to tell my boss? Is my job secure? Am I going to be able to come back to work? We'll find out. My boss is thinking, well, pregnant, how I worked so hard to attract the very best talent. I feel like I've been kicked in the gut. How is this possible? How is it possible that it can have such a huge impact from just one tiny red line? because we have employees who say, I'll be back in six weeks after my little one arrives. I never want to leave the company. Yeah, I'm not coming back. 74% of women say they want to return after they have their baby. 34% actually do. That's a huge disparity and there's something we can do about it. So while pregnancy announcements are exciting for everybody, they're a logistical nightmare for their employers who already start backfilling their positions long before they ever walk out the door. I'm motivated to continue serving expectant families as I've done for over 20 years, but I'm able to do so in a greater capacity this way. And employers, quite frankly, they lack the knowledge of individual needs throughout the maternity process. They're HR people and they're wonderful, but right now what they usually do is hand them a slip of paper that tells them who are approved um, vendors. That does nothing to help and it's overwhelming. So the bottom line is turnover is costly. If you are not investing in your employees, you're losing up to the value of two times their salary. And each employee that you lose can cost you 213% of their salary. As Sir Richard Branson puts it, putting your staff first translates into success for your customers, your shareholders, and your overall business. Quite frankly, it's just smart business. So Maternity Momentum offers strategies to attract, retain, educate, and maintain. You have to attract the millennials and the Gen Xers who are wanting to settle down and have babies, and we want them to continue having babies. We just like them to come back to work. Once you get them, you need to retain them. And to do so, you want to help them stay focused and working for you. Once they're pregnant, they have so much competing for their attention. These are strategies that will maximize employee retention so that they can stay focused. And instead of being online searching for all the things they need to welcome their new one, they can work with myself or another strategist who will find the ideal vendors to support them. Everything from acupuncturists to keep them comfortable all the way to Zen birth and everything in between. Education is key because educated employees become informed medical consumers who have fewer cesareans, who are able to come back to work healthier and happier as are their babies. And they're not trying to recover from a major abdominal surgery. Then you have the maintain portion, which is really important because women don't just drop babies and have you say, well, come on back to work. They need, really focused support. They need postpartum support. If they have to travel for you, for example, which is rare these days, but if they do, then they need to consider their newborn, especially if they're nursing. So they may need a place to pump breast milk, to store breast milk and to ship it to their newborn, or they're gonna to have to travel with the travel nanny. We have companies who have already vetted travel nannies who can assist with that and we will assist you. So we offer three pricing options. One is $200 just for small companies who may only have one or two employees who are pregnant. 
uh, and or expecting. It could be the men who have someone else who is having a baby for them. We support that too, we support whatever. So for eight hours weekly or once a day, you can have myself or my staff at your disposal full-time regardless of how many employees you have for 75,000 flat rate. And the same goes for larger companies, your tech companies, that's about 200, thousand annually for unlimited strategy and support, but you don't have to pay for vacations and you don't have to pay benefits and bonuses, etc. This is scalable internationally. I alone as a one person army certainly can't do it. I can only serve five companies, which I'm happy to do. But with proven procedures and policies and practice, my maternity consultants are trained to act in my stead. And consultants who know the local culture are prepared to use my vetting procedures for local vendors. My current challenges are getting through the gatekeepers to the decision makers, demonstrating truly a win-win-win proposal. You're attracting great talent and you're keeping them while reducing attrition and being able to increase the employee focus because when they're laser focused on working for you, will be laser focused on getting exactly who they need to support the birth that they want. And pricing, do you feel that it is sustainable, fair, and flexible? My three questions is how would you personally structure the fee schedule rather than just a flat rate if you would change that? To whom would you turn for warm introductions? And what type of companies do you feel would most benefit from maternity momentum, i.e. tech companies, um, perhaps education companies, et cetera. I am anxious to hear your feedback. I've put this up here for ease so you can jot something down if you'd like to get a hold of me after this. That is my website and it'll tell you a little more about what I do. Thank you so much for sharing your time and attention. I'm so excited to hear your feedback.